and today we are going to start up the Corvette yes the Corvette is going to run today Shea Bear has got it pretty well together there's still odds and ends but it's enough to make it out of this driveway so we're gonna film this because this is a big event it has not been done moved except it was moved from here from Summerfield to here on a flatbed. It hasn't run on its own power in seven years. Yes. It hasn't, hasn't run in seven years. So this is a good day. So hopefully it'll go down. We can't go too far because the tires are dry rotted and we'll have to buy them. Probably in a couple months we'll be able to. Um, and then we can take it down the road a little bit more. And I also have to get insured. And we're going to put an antique plate on it. And we're hoping to maybe do some car shows with it. After we get it all buffed up and make it look pretty. Mm -hmm. So, anyways, here we go. And if you want to watch Shaber 1000's videos on the Corvette, go to his playlist. And he has the whole thing. And how, what he had to do to get this thing going. So, here we go. Okay guys, so here we go. going to go on the road maybe I don't think so though because the tires are really bad so that one tire might just um, split if we even go far so sounds good the only thing he has to do is the backup lights are not working for whatever reason every all the other lights are working it's nice that he can uh, move it. There it goes. It sounds good. Bit of smoke. Well, that's black. That's gas. Yeah. Well, that was probably that lawnmower stuff, right? No. no. Just burn a lot of fuel because they got it turned way up. Remember? Uh huh. So there you go. We got it going. The reverse is slipping. Is it bad? Well, I felt it right there. Um, there's no brakes. None. Oh. Wonder why. No. There's fluid in it, right? Yeah. Oh. Probably master cylinder or something. Maybe. Maybe. Oh, wow. If you move that off of there, I can sweep that all off. All right. Yeah. That'll be cool. There you go. Where's your blower? I know that off there. Mm, shed. I can go get it. No biggie. All right, so I'm gonna blow that stuff off the sh off the driveway there since we got it moved. It's nice to be able to move it because what I want to do is 
We want to move the truck up so he can start working on the truck too. So, and that'll be nice. Just nice to be able to move it around. I don't like how there's no brakes though. But he'll get that fixed. There you go. It actually moved. Yay! Alright, so I'm going to do the driveway real quick On and its own come back. Power, first time in seven years. Yep. That we know has been at least seven years. Oh, yeah. Definitely. Well, a little over seven years, according to the tag. Yeah, because he would never run it without a tag on it. He couldn't where he was. He would have gotten in trouble. So, yeah. Awesome. There you go. So, quite happy. At least it's moving around a little bit. That's what our goal was, at least to get that far. And, of course, there'll be things that need to be done. I mean, it's old. It, you know, it hasn't been, it's been sitting in a garage, and then it's been sitting out here for two years. So, you know, it's been, been a battle a little bit. And for all those people that have been driving back and forth and wanting to buy this <laughs> sucker, kiss my butt. You should have bought it when you had a chance. So... There you pretty go. peppy, don't it? Yeah, and you know, nobody wanted to give us anything because they could, they, they, they're lazy. They don't, they want a car, but they don't want to do the work for it. That's the problem. Well, apparently they don't understand what project car means. No, when you they got don't. A project car right. sale, that means you're not going to right. get in it and drive it to the next no. show. No, you are it's going to take your time and, and you're going to do it. Now there was only one person that I thought that was really going to buy it. And that was the guy that had the Corvette himself and that he had already had one and he had a project and his wife wouldn't let him have another one until he got that well, one he, done. He was going to frame off restoration on his. So yes. his was in pieces. Yeah, yeah. And she didn't want him to buy another no. one until that one got finished. But and I'm... Dave up here wanted it. I'm wondering if he wanted to... Um, he wanted to... He wanted to... T I thought maybe he wanted to take the body and put it on his... Mm -hmm. That's what I thought. I think he wanted the engine. Because uh, he, he, he said he had to rebuild his engine. Oh. Uh, so I think he was wanting that engine out of there. Uh, so it would have moved along a little bit faster. Maybe he was getting tired. I don't know. Yeah, because that engine souped up. Yeah. And I toned it down. And yeah. You can hear it's peppy. Yeah. When you hear that blah, 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 yeah. blah, 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 blah. Yeah. <laughs> it's, it's, no. got, it's got a little cam in it. Right. So. Anyways, I'm going to blow off the driveway while he's got that out of there and... Uh, yeah, so we got it going, and yep, so all those people who could not, did not want to buy it, well, yeah, lost out, so I'm going to keep it, and hopefully we'll be able to put it in some shows, maybe, maybe, what, maybe a year, maybe, you think? Uh -huh. you th yeah, okay. I get, he gave me two years, and he's way ahead of his years, so I figure maybe a year, and we might be able to put it in some shows. Oh, we need tires and brakes. We gotta buff it up, make it pretty. Yeah, but that's just you know, that's you know. So, um, you know, yeah. I figure I get the tires in a few months. That's what my goal is. So, yeah. All right, guys. Monkey Sushi out for now. Hope you enjoyed the videos, and don't forget to check out Shea Bear One Thousand's videos on the Corvette. He's got every one of them that he's done the work on. I cannot explain it all because. It's too difficult. So it's just best if you go and watch them and then you'll know what he's done and what he hasn't done and stuff like that. So anyways, have a great weekend and I'll see you in the next one. Bye, y'all. Okay, Shaver's going to back it back in and he's got Bruno with him. Because Bruno's been dying to go for a ride. He's way in there. See you. Here we go. Bruno's going for a ride. He's been dying to get in that car. Every time that he comes out here to work on it, he gets upset because we didn't move it. Now we get to move it. That dog is something. I, I swear, he's not a dog. He's a little boy and a dog. It's amazing. Shea Beer comes out here to work on it. Bruno's right there. He had a little ride. There you go. There we 
you go. Okay, guys. Bye.